and state reps in New Hampshire don't get an elaborate salary like state reps in most other states. They get $100 per year. And we're actually privileged to have three uh, either current or former state reps in our presence. And one of them who is a current state rep and opted, I believe, to not be a college student uh, decided to go into the public sector. Uh, Mr. Caleb Dyer, who on February 9th officially became a sitting Libertarian state rep and has changed his voter registration, meaning that for the first time in nearly 20 years, we have a state rep serving the majority of their term as a Libertarian. Caleb Dyer. At the State House, it is a very, very cutthroat game. It is very real. They have a lot more power than they should. And that's one of the things that I think very few Republicans and very few Democrats are working earnestly to reduce. And because they have such power, because they have such influence, they fight like hell to make sure that they keep it. And I saw very many of my Republican colleagues, some Libertarian Republicans even, who play this game and they make sure, even if they don't necessarily agree with the fact that that power is held by their colleagues, they are by and way ensuring that their colleagues have that power and that they themselves have that power as well. And I was for lack of a better word, I was disgusted by that. And, you know, I, I got into it, I, I would say, with probably the purest of intentions. Um, but, you know, I quickly realized that, you know, no matter how good your intentions are, if the office demands something of you, um, you'll be expected to give that. And I'm fine with the time commitment. I'm fine with the work that it requires. But I'm not fine with propping up people who should not have that kind of power, and I'm not fine with supporting them. And when I realized what games were being played, when I realized that I was in, you know, complicit in those games, I had to leave. I had to do it. Ask a Libertarian Facebook fan page is spreading awareness of libertarianism and informing non-libertarians while empowering those who support liberty on a daily basis. This is your opportunity to be empowered and let us advocate libertarianism for you at facebook.com slash ask a libertarian.